For centuries, the names that scientists have used to label different life forms have served to organize and connect knowledge about what we today call biodiversity. But without other tools and sensors, humans' ability to observe organisms have been limited by our own senses. What we can see, touch, hear, and smell. Despite knowing that a drop of water, teaspoon of soil, or breath of air may contain a multitude of species, we've been unable to detect their presence efficiently, much less describe, quantify, or name them. From the first microscope to DNA sequencing, technology has revolutionized our ability to detect, discover, and tally other life forms. By analyzing the evolutionary signals from DNA molecules, scientists can now consistently find and identify the evolutionary signatures, or DNA barcodes, for organisms that we previously overlooked or couldn't even see. Conventions for using DNA to name new organisms are not yet consistent, making it a challenge for researchers who want to connect new and old forms of biodiversity evidence. But by collaborating with geneticists, GBIF now displays DNA-derived data alongside other specimens and observation records to offer a better reflection of the full range of life on Earth. By assembling data from different sources, GBIF enables cutting-edge research and expands the biodiversity evidence available for science and policy. To learn more on how GBIF works to provide a more complete and inclusive picture of life on Earth, visit gbif.org DNA.